Hi all. I just thought I'd show you my garbage can contraption here. I got the lid chained to a piece of 4x4 four four so it doesn't blow away. And uh, it worked here last night. We had like uh, 40 mile an hour winds and the uh, lid and the 4x4 four four were way over here about about 10 feet away. So it definitely worked. That's just an old piece of chain. I dunked it in some white paint. I got a uh, neat part is uh, neat part is I got a lock nut on here. It's got a like plastic inside here, so it locks the place. So this will still rotate around, but it stays tight. But any nut and bolt will work fine. You know, it doesn't have to be that lock nut. So that's what I do when I put out the trash. Now I got it set up to where I can take this off. Kind of hard to do one-handed here. Okay, so I, I got it set up to where when I'm not putting out the trash, I can lock it on here, on this side. Yeah. And then over on this side, I, I got the same thing. And I, I can put, the, and then over on this side, I got the same thing. I could snap it like that so the uh, raccoons can't get in there. The smart ones can probably still get it open, but she, she's pretty tight. So I've been fiddling with this for a couple weeks now and this seems to work. These trash cans have uh, holes in the handles. I guess that's to let the water drain out. And I used to just put a bungee cord on here. And uh, that works great. That that works fine too. But uh, I started fiddling around with these chains. It seems to make it a little easier. Bungee cord always falls on the ground. But always got to hunt for it. So that's why I ended up with the chains. So... This kind of blew away last night. That might not even be heavy enough. But uh, it's light enough where it's not so bad to carry it around. Okay, see ya. Bye. One last tip. Always give your trash cans a good rinse. Because if you don't, you'll get maggots growing in them. And they're just nasty. Okay? See ya. Bye.